Hi, this is Janos, it's Real World Audio, and we are continuing our exploration of the Darling Amplifier. And uh, I'm continuing because I am rebuilding my, my Darling Amp. Actually, this was Tomás's Darling Amplifier. When we built our Darlings, we built uh, three of them, and this is number three. This is Tomás's. I have already shown my other two, but I have modified them to an extreme extent. So, actually, my my darling that was my darling, it, I don't think it can be called darling anymore because neither the driver stage, neither the power stage is of the darling amplifier. Uh, but that's how it started and bears a lot of similarity on the inside with this darling, especially the power supply section. And uh, now coming back to this darling, uh, uh, I had a few comments and remarks on my uh, on, on in post that I would like to address now. And one of the posts was that uh, uh, one of you has built uh, a pure darling and was really disappointed uh, with uh, the uh, measurements that, that, that you did on it, that the uh, THD was, was just off the charts, like 40%. And you said that the 1.5K uh, resistor for the driver stage was really off. And, and I thought at first that, geez, I must have been really ill to recommend 1.5K for the driver stage and uh, and I really apologized for that and then now I just wanted to double check what the heck I, I recommended I, was I that sick or what's going on so I looked at my uh, website the real world audio blog and looked up how can you look it up if you go there and you click on audio gear what? Hey. Okay, I think I need to reload it. Yes. Okay, audio gear. You click on it and there's like pure darling, baby darling, da da da. And when you click on pure darling, it will show you the schematics. Let me just recenter a little bit. Uh, but, but then I realized R4 power tube cathode resistor R4 jeez what R4 uh, R4 750 for the power tube jeez yeah so that's not right where did I find it where did I find it use Two 750 ohm resistors in series. Yeah, that, that's way off. Oh my. I recommend it. 1.5k. Let's, let's come back here. Oh, where was I? Here. So let's look at the original Darling. And they recommend 500 ohm. Uh, resistor for the two tubes so that means like 1k each for the power stage uh, so that that's kind of kind of okay uh, that that's in the ballpark uh, however for the input tube uh, what I was recommending there input tube 400 ohm input tube cathode resistor so it's not point not uh, 1.5 k just 400 ohms and um, yeah so so that's what you should use and you should not use 1.5 k for the input tube cathode resistor uh, that that that's a, that that's way too high and that that should not work so yep uh, and when we go to the original Darling, if you look at that, so this is what they do. Uh, Bob Daniliak used 200 ohm resistor for the pair of the input tubes. That's equivalent to 400 ohm each 
if you do separate then you need to double the resistance because half the current flows so this is my exact same recommendation and and I'm recommending to use a little bit higher than 500 ohms uh, let's see so if you use 500 ohm for the pair of the 1626 that's equivalent to one kilo ohm for each so if you take it separate to each then that becomes 1k each and I was recommending 1.5k and why is that? Uh, to run it a little bit uh, lower in current because I think he was running it very uh, very high current I think like 25 milliamp was it? Uh, I have to have to think more about that uh, but um, anyway I found that it's best to to keep the current a little bit down for the 2026 and that's what I will be doing here with mine too that I will a little bit curtail the, the current so I've been also doing what Bob Danielak did uh, running the 1626 at higher than 20 milliamps of uh, current um, and actually even with that the tubes last a, a really really long time uh, and they they are b basically uh, if you run them higher than 20 milliamps at, at their peak rated plate voltage that's pretty much abusing them and, and it's taking away from their lifespan but even with that uh, the tubes in mines and, and, and the other darlings we built they lasted for years and years and years for five years easily so with my plan of running them a little bit more conservatively uh, we are really guarantee that you can run a, a pair of tube, power tubes like for seven, eight, nine years without changing it uh, provided you use this amplifier like six, seven hours a day and, and that's what I've been using my darling amps about six to ten, twelve hours a day every day so, so that's the usage that I am subjecting them to and um, yeah so this is what I wanted to share with you guys now just uh, touching base again on the cathode resistors for the driver stage and for the power stage uh, this is what Bob Danielak recommends 200 ohms for a pair of the driver tubes or 400 ohms each what I have been using with my Darling amplifier and ours that was 365 ohm each so that's a little bit lower than the original Darling but it's close enough and um, that's something that I never played around with uh, but I'm really curious how it would sound if we would uh, drop it a little bit I mean drop the current a little bit which means upping the resistance so anyway that will be one thing that I will find out I will also increase the uh, cathode resistor to 200 ohm for the pair or 400 ohm each I will try it out 400 ohm each which is with the pure darling so that's the difference between the baby darling and pure darling that with the baby version the cathodes are shared and the pure darling the cathodes are per tube and both for driver and the output stage and uh, I think that's it for this video uh, and, um, and thank you guys for watching and thank you so much for, for those of you who have built uh, the darling amps who are building them and, and I really hope that me uh, doing the rebuild here and sharing my observations will help you to guide and give you pointers on how to make yours better or um, yeah or how to do little improvements and little things to be to have a look at so thank you everyone have an awesome day bye bye